Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Sydney, and if you guys are new, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you enjoy this video, please give it a like. So first things first, if you're a male watching this video, you can keep watching. I'm not gonna tell you not to, but I'm just gonna like warn, warn you there's a little bit of like TMI in this video. And um, maybe you can help out your girlfriend or whoever you're with, your swole mate, when they're on their period. Um, so yeah. So we're gonna talk about three things. The products that I use, nutrition and exercise. And if you guys want to follow me on any of my social medias or check out my channel, feel free to do that. I would really appreciate it. If anyone has any recommendations that they use when they're on their period, comment it down below. So first things first, products. I use three different products when I'm on my period. I use panty liners, which are from Carefree, and they are the thong kind. These panty liners have literally saved my life because sometimes I bleed a lot and sometimes I bleed like very little, so I bleed through my tampon. And these things are the like angel above. But um, I always get the thong ones because no matter if I'm on my period or not, I always wear thongs, especially in the gym. So this brand has really good ones for thongs. I just get them at the drugstore. There's 49 of them and they're unscented, which is really great. The next thing is tampons. So there are two tampon brands that I will use, but my favorite one is actually Cora. Cora has a movement of their own, which I think is absolutely amazing. I commend Molly, who's the founder of it, for even starting this brand. She just has such an amazing vision. Her like movement that she has for Cora is anytime someone buys a month's supply of Cora, she donates another month's supply to a girl. In if someone were to get like a month's supply of the Cora brand, it comes with a few different things, which I love. Um, first of all, the sleek box, which I literally can have in my room, and no one would know that inside of this I have tampons. They come with supers and regulars. So there's a box of premium cotton. So these tampons are actually made from premium organic cotton. These are the super. They have really cute, soft packaging. They have the regular, which are right here. But they come with those boxes. The other thing that comes in the package is this really cute, like, it looks like a lipstick holder, but it actually holds your tampon. It just looks like you're going to the bathroom to put lipstick on. So these just are so cute and pretty. And then it also comes with another tampon holder, which just looks like this. I think you can put, like, Maybe a pad or panty liner in it too. They're all just great quality products. The movement is amazing. And I love the fact that the applicator is BPA free and you're not like putting disgusting things into your body. I've tried literally every tampon company out there. And hands down, Cora brand is actually higher than my favorite, my like ultimate favorite before I ever tried Cora was Kotex by You. And now Cora has taken the cake. They have amazing tampons they're just so sleek and nice and i just feel like it's better quality because of the fact that inside of it i'm putting something into my body and it doesn't have all those disgusting chemicals in it and i'm actually treating my body better than i had in the past like five years of having my period so those are the products that i use on my period uh, medication wise for cramps I will either use like Aleve or Pamperin. I stay away from ibuprofen just because that does mess up your stomach lining and if you take too much of it, obviously that can cause a health problem. Now on to nutrition. So for nutrition, I am either the person that doesn't eat anything on their period or a week before I gorge myself like to the point where you're like, Sydney, are you gonna blow up? Like that's how, that's how much I eat. So first, before I even tell you guys like the snacks that I eat, and everything I want to say, try to stay as close to possible as what you're eating and keep your goals in mind. Personally, for me, I eat chicken with salsa. Even though it has sodium in it, you're going to be bloated no matter what. Um, I don't recommend that you step on the scale if you're someone that gets affected by what the scale says, but you gain up to like five pounds. Another thing to stay away from is caffeine and pre-workout. I know, I know, I'm a pre-workout junkie and I do drink monsters and everything like that but I do not drink them when I'm on my period. I sometimes even stay away from green tea just because some of it does have caffeine and it causes you to cramp up more and you become more dehydrated. So I recommend sticking to water and decaffeinated tea. And then as 
for snacks, I really, really, really love the brand PE Science. For anyone who does not know PE Science, number one, I'm just going to say this right now because I feel like someone's going to think that I'm sponsored by them. I wish I were, but I'm not, and I truly believe in their product. I honestly 100% believe in the fact that their protein tastes better than anything I've ever had in my entire life. I have a huge sweet tooth. You can seriously make anything from protein balls to waffles to um, those like cake in a mugs. You can make so many things with this protein. You can just drink it by itself, but it's amazing and it tastes great. If you guys are looking for one to try out, I recommend you always try out Snickerdoodle first, unless you're going to get multiple um, flavors. If I want something that's already pre-made and I'm really lazy like that, because sometimes in my period I'm just really lazy and I don't feel like cooking, um, which is what leads me to my unhealthy choices, I will get a Flapjack Mighty Muffin, which has 24 grams of protein and like 24 grams of carbs. Like it's pretty even. With that, I recommend that you get the chocolate kind. It's my favorite. And then Lenny and Larry's. So these cookies are to die for. These are my favorite cookies ever. There's two servings in these. So when you're looking at the back, make sure that you multiply it by two if you're like me and you're going to eat both servings. As for spreads and peanut butters and things like that, if I'm just craving a peanut butter, what I like to do instead is take the organic PB Fit and make some of this rather than Skippy because it's only 50 calories. It's higher in protein. There's like six grams of protein in this and like 1.4 grams of fat or something. So the difference between like a peanut butter and then this um, peanut butter powder is bit very different. All you do is mix it with water. But then if you want something that's already pre-made that you can literally take a scoop of and just eat a serving of it, the Buff Bake Birthday Cake or White Chocolate is hands down delicious. And these are actually um, protein almond spreads. This one has 11 grams of protein. The next brand that I really like is Nuts and More. I don't recommend all of their flavors, like the cookie butter one, do not try it. I really like the salted caramel, white chocolate. Last but not least, for those of you who have a sweet tooth and you like soda or you like um, fruit punch or you know juice or anything, Aminos, BCAAs. Drink those like nobody's business. I know sometimes they can be kind of expensive, but when you think about it, in the long run, number one, these are gonna help with muscle recovery, and number two, they're going to help your cravings because you can get a flavor. So like this one that I have right here is Mango Splash. I put this in my drink any time of the day. It helps me drink my water. It also has my BCAAs. It has the aminos that I need. If I can find coupon codes for you guys, obviously I'll put them down below. The one for BE Science is not my coupon code, but it is one that I use when I order from them, which does get you 30% off, which I love. So the last section of this video that I'm going to be talking about is exercise. Size. I know, I know, I know. You want to curl up in bed and never leave your bed when you're on your period because two things, cramps and cramps. Exercise is going to help. It's going to do two things. First thing, it's going to give you endorphins, which is going to make you happy and you're not going to be as PMS, emotional, crazy b that a lot of us can be. And then the second thing is it's going to help with your cramps. Um, you might go into your workout having cramps. So like personally for me, I do a lot of cardio because cardio helps. Running, getting active, moving around, even yoga really helps. So if you guys want to get active, go for a walk, go for a hike, even do some hit on the treadmill. Um, personally for me, I usually up my cardio when I'm on my period just because it makes me feel better, I have less cramps, and I also feel like I'm sweating out all the disgusting bloat that I currently have. So when I walk out of the gym, I am on the happiest <laughs> level I can ever be on just because I have endorphins running through me, I'm listening to great positive music, and my family knows that I'm going to be a new person when I get back home that's not crying or screaming at them because I just went to the gym. We've all been there, we've all done that, we all have our moments. I love you guys so 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 much and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. If you guys are new to my fit fam, then don't forget to subscribe. Check me out on my social medias, they're all down below. Add me on Snapchat because I love talking to you guys. I will get hella TMI on Snapchat. Sometimes I talk about things that you're just like, Sydney, did you really just do that? Yes, I did. Yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it some love. I will talk to you guys in my next video. If you guys have any advice for anyone on their period and how to be healthy, leave it in the comments down below. I love you guys with all my heart and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.